in terms of this uh, 3D printed uh, post office building, that's the spirit of India today. That's the spirit with which our country is progressing today. Built over a thousand square feet of land parcel, this is India's first 3D printed post office building. Yes, this whole building has been printed. These walls you see have been put in place by a 3D printer. And not by masons as you might have seen, manually laying brick over brick. Almost magical, isn't it? Union Minister Ashwini Vashnav inaugurated India's first post office building built using a 3D printer. This post office building is located in Bangalore. For those of you who are wondering how could a building be printed as opposed to building it manually, you need to understand how 3D printing works. Once a blueprint for the building is in place, instead of it being translated onto the ground by construction workers, a 3D printer takes a digital drawing to print a physical structure. The structure is built according to the dimensions and details specified by engineers, for instance, whether a particular wall is load-bearing and what's the ideal thickness required. The printing process involves placing different construction materials in layers using a robotic printer. 3D printing technology deposits concrete layer by layer according to the 3D model drawing input. The process requires maintaining a delicate balance between concrete properties including flowability, quick hardening for load-bearing capacity, green concrete status for interlaying bonding, and sufficient strength to ensure successful printing. A 3D concrete printer includes a motion assembly, a dry mix material feeding system, a continuous mixer, pumping unit and an operating software that controls the motion assembly. While a 3D printer follows blueprints to build walls, pillars and roof, any additional elements including windows, doors as well as electrical and plumbing systems are put in place later. What do you think of India's first 3D printed post office? Now think of the immense potential this technology holds for building cheaper homes at scale for India's large population. This technology could prove to be a game changer when it comes to building better and cheaper. Don't forget to share your thoughts with us in the comment section and to like and share this video and to subscribe to The Mint. Tomatoes look good. What should I grow next year though? How can my farm adapt to climate change? You only progress when you ask better questions. Mint. Think ahead, think growth.